Hello my dear student, students, welcome in biology class, class 10th, chapter number 9 is going on, that is heredity and evolution today, part 5th. In this chapter, we, will, we already learned about the different term that is genetics, heredity, variation and father of genetics, Mendel's law, monohybrid and dihybrid cross. So, Today I am going to describe sex determination by which we can identify the sex of the offspring and give the name this is male and female. So let us consider one by one point wise here sex determination determination of sex of an offspring factors which are responsible for the sex determination are environmental factor and genetic factor two factors on the basis of environmental factor in some animal the temperature at which fertilized egg are kept decide the gender of that particular animal in some animal temperature is responsible for the on the basis of temperature and environmental condition that shows the their gender for example in turtle for example in the turtle the, so in turtle gender of this turtle is decided uh, on depend upon the temperature on which the fertilized eggs, eggs are the kept so first one is the environmental factor in some animals shows the basis of the fertilized egg on the basis of their temperature condition second one is the on the basis of genetic label in some animal just like human being human beings human genders are individual is determined determined by a pair of chromosome that is called sex chromosome in humans the sex of the human is, is determined by the chromosome that is also called sex chromosome. So sex chromosome in the human is X X capital X X shows the female and capital X Y shows the male chromosome. This is the male, male and female, female and male chromosome which determine the sex of the that particular organism in the human being. So, this is the general way factors responsible for the determination. Two factors. First one is the environmental, second one is the genetic. On the basis of gen environmental factor, uh, in the specific temperature, some animals they have fertilized egg that kept and so the uh, their gender. For example, in the turtle. And on the basis of genetic label, in the genetic, in animals, for, for example, in the human being, sex is defined, uh, de decide on the basis of the pair of the chromosome that is also called sex chromosome. In the human being, XX shows the female chromosome and XY shows the male chromosome. Is mein hum log itna hi abhi jaan rahe hai, sex determination. Kaise kisi aap spring ka determination kiya jaya ki ye male hai ki female hai. तो दो फैक्टर हैं एक इन्वायरमेंटल फैक्टर दूसरा है जेनेटिक फैक्टर इन्वायरमेंटल फैक्टर में कुछ एनिमल हैं जिसमें उसके टेम्परेचर पर स्पेसिफिक टेम्परेचर पर कोई उसका फर्टिलाइज एक होगा जो कि कैप्ट किया जाएगा उससे डिसाइड होगा कि कौन सा जेंडर है इसका लेकिन फॉर एग्जाम्पल इन इन्वायरमेंटल लेवल टर्टिल ऐसे बहुत से एग्जाम्पल हैं दूसरा क्या है जेनेटिक जेनेटिक लेवल पर इसमें यहाँ पर जेनेटिक्स में क्रोमोजोम आएंगे सो ह्यूमन बीइंग में के सेक्स को डिसाइड करने के लिए तो उसके पेयर ऑफ क्रोमोजोम पर डिपेंड है तो इसको हम लोग सेक्स क्रोमोजोम कहते हैं तो जेनेटिक्स लेवल पे कैपिटल एक्स एक्स सोस द फीमेल क्रोमोजोम से आर सेक्स क्रोमोजोम एंड एक्स वाई द फीमेल सॉरी मेल सेक्स क्रोमोजोम दिस इज ऑल अबाउट इंट्रोडक्शन ऑफ द हाउ वी कैन फाइंड द Sex of the offspring.
next is the sex chromosome we are talking about the sex chromosomes are the responsible for the uh, identification of the sex about the sex of the offspring that is male and female so, so question arises here what is sex chromosome so let us consider one by one their definition uh, about sex chromosome what is sex chromosome in the human being in human beings 23 pair of chromosome is uh, found out of these 22 chromosomes are autosomes and last pair last pair of the chromosome help in deciding gender of that individual that is called sex chromosome simple tarike se kya hai kisi bhi human being mein 23 pairs 23 pairs kya paaye jate hain chromosome paaye jate hain pairs mein 23 pairs और यही कितने हुए सिंपली कभी-कभी क्वेश्चन आता है हाउ मेनी क्रोमोसोम फाउंड इन द ह्यूमन बीइंग्स सो 23 इन पेयर एंड 46 टोटल पेयर में है 23 23 हो जाएगी कितना 46 क्रोमोसोम पाए जाएंगे यहां पे 46 क्रोमोसोम इन द ह्यूमन बीइंग्स 23 इन द पेयर 23 पेयर क्रोमोसोम पाए जाते हैं सब में बट only 22 chromosomes in which the 22 chromosomes are autosomes autosomes they are matched together and last last one is the last one plus one is responsible for the deciding the sex of that particular individual ये last वाला जो होगा इससे क्या पता चलेगा कि वो male है कि female है मेल और फीमेल के बारे में पता चलेगा किसके उस पार्टिकुलर इंडिविजुअल का जिसका हम लोग सेक्स डिटरमाइन करेंगे सो so सिंपली इन ह्यूमन बीइंग 23 पेयर क्रोमोसोम इज फाउंड आउट ऑफ दिस 22 पेयर इज रिस्पांसिबल फॉर द 24 22 आर्स द ऑटोसोम्स एंड लास्ट वन लास्ट पेयर इज रिस्पांसिबल फॉर डिसाइडिंग द जेंडर ऑफ दैट इंडिविजुअल that is called sex chromosome. So once again, capital X, capital X, X, X is responsible for the female and X, Y is responsible for the male. This is about sex chromosome. Next one is the sex de determination by the sex chromosomes. How? It is a shown sex chromosome. Here you can see this is father and mother. They are simply known as the parents. They are the parents which that responsible for the producing new young ones or offspring. So how uh, can deciding the uh, male and female in the from their parents means father. Father have that is male sex organ X Y and mother have X X is the female chromosome. We know that X X for female X Y for the male. So after they are the X Y when separated that is formed with the single unit that is gamete X Y X X and after here fusion zygote for after the fusion gamete call of spring. This one is the cross. This X, this X. You can see X, X. This X, second X, X, X. And Y, Y first, Y, X, Y. And this Y, uh, X, Y. So probability here, this one, both are female. Both are female. And here, 50% probability of probability of female child here 50% probability of female child because x x already we know that this one is the female sex chromosome and here they are this is male x y here 50% probability 
फिफ्टी परसेंट प्रोबेबिलिटी ऑफ मेल चाइल्ड बाय दिस फिगर इट्स सो दैन फ्रॉम देयर कैनिक फ्यूजन ऑफ स्प्रिंग इन दिस फर्स्ट बी गर्ट यक्स यक्स मींस दिस हाफ पार्ट सो द फिफ्टी परसेंट प्रोबेबिलिटी फिफ्टी परसेंट इज द फीमेल चाइल्ड एंड फिफ्टी परसेंट इज द मेल चाइल्ड and that is so the this so here half part is near about he mean child and half part is the male child so we can conclude that the, this x chromosome of mother is deciding the females and y chromosome of father deciding the genders of the male and female so here probability we can see x y and x x these are the sex chromosome x y x so the female when x x get result the female uh, gender and when this one x y is combined to x is called x y that is for this one so for the male sex hormone so we can can find the when father and mother when male sex hormone and female sex hormone combined together there will be probability of half part is a female child and half part is the male child that shows the gender of the particular individual in the sex determination so this is all about sex determination in this chapter B learn chapter number nine heredity and evolution. Evolution part is related from the uh, CBSE or NCERT. So in this year, in this academic year, so only we learn about the genetics, variation, heredity, Mendel's experiment, mono hybrid, di hybrid. At last, today I discussed about the sex determination. How uh, human beings are. and their parents is deciding this is male and female on the basis of their chromosome that is paired chromosome also known as sex chromosome